I just want to take a moment and hopefully encourage you just a little bit. It seems that as I read the news, Facebook feed, social media, every place, there's just more and more bad news. My heart is grieved for those families and those lives that were touched in Texas. But beyond that, we still have lingering effects from COVID and long-term COVID. And then on top of that, I read that monkeypox is coming and it seems that there's always another tragedy, another trial, something else that's difficult in life. And my heart hurts for all the people that are affected by these tragedies, all the people that are touched by these hardships. As you continue to watch the news or watch the, the different avenues, you find all these random solutions. And I'm not here to get in the middle of these solutions and say, listen, that I know the answer. Because quite frankly, I don't know that I have the right answer in each situation. But I want to encourage you because sometimes life just seems so hard. Sometimes there seems to be no way but down. And the Bible tells us, the Bible teaches us, the Bible explains to us that God in Psalm 46 verse 1 is our refuge and strength, a very present help in our time of trouble. And there are times that you and I and people around us will be troubled. There are times that we will feel overwhelmed. And my friend, God wants to be your refuge. A refuge is a place that you can run to and find security. A place you can run to and find comfort. A place that is safe inside of these walls. And my friend, I can promise you that God is the very best refuge. You can run to him. He can help you. He can bring you strength and hope. And I am so thankful for a God who even when the world is all upside down and chaos in every corner, that God is our strength and refuge.